Let's try this again. Hi, <laughs> my name is Valentine. Or and I am in studio with a very amazing gentleman, one of the guests, DJ. His name is DJ D. And of course, our super. doesn't happen often, so let's tell the truth. Eh, we don't get as much swag as this every day. Yeah, please introduce yourself one more time. I apologize for the technical difficulties, baby boys and girls. What's good, my people? Uh -huh. It's the continental boy, King Perry Point Day, mm -hmm. season of the world. Tell me what, who King Perry is. What does he stand for? King Perry is the season of the world. King Perry is the continental boy. You know, King Perry is a cool guy, laid back. Uh -huh. You know, I make the continental sound. King Perry is also very stubborn. I'll give you that one for free. <laughs> for free. He's just very... Uh, How did you know that? Why are you like this? <laughs> How did you know that? You just are. Conversation with you for two minutes already, I can oh, tell you. Very stubborn. Nice. Very uh, stubborn. Nice. You're, you're smart. <laughs> oh, yeah. I am smart. I'm very smart. Mm -hmm. All right. Tell me about your... Is it album? Yes. You've called it Citizen of the World. Yeah. Um, Citizen of the World is a masterpiece. I mean, it's not just an album, it's an identity, you know, it's a mind state. It's me saying if you do something, like if you do whatever you do with your craft that brings people from different parts of the world together, you know, through your craft, you are a citizen of the world. If you are aware of yourself, you know, if you are aware of your environment, you are a citizen of the world, you know. And like this is me, you know, with my music, spreading love to the world and bringing like people from different parts of the world together you know i'm here in kenya you know and they love my music here you know so they do in brazil you know america like different parts of the world you know so i'm saying like if you if you're not just of one place you are a citizen of the world you know there's no boundaries to this thing we do mm -hmm. you know, yeah. how many countries have been to i've been to like four ghana kenya um uganda um, which again, um, I think I shot, I shot Yawa video in Benin Republic. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. What's your favorite country of those four and why? I love Ghana and I love Kenya too. I love, I love all of them, you know, cause <laughs> they all have one thing in common, you know, uh -huh. nature, the vibes, nature vibes, you know, so, and wherever you find trees, that's where you find me. Oh, I kind of. <laughs> so, so no, no, kisama na penda minti mutani jazz, but I like trees too. <laughs> yeah, so amazing. I can see you. I like trees too, guys. Hashtag is Social Friday. Okay, why is Ghana always fighting with Nigeria over jollof? I don't know, but like I love Nigerian jollof so much that uh -huh. when I go to a place, the first thing, I, the first thing I ask is, do you guys have Nigerian jollof? Uh huh. All so right. like, yeah. I don't. I can't. St I can't say that. I can't say for Ghana, you know, because I love Nigerian jello for love. Uh huh. Uh huh. Have you tried yeah. eating Kenyan food? Not really. Not you, really. Why are you afraid? I, yeah, because I'm, I'm very sensitive. Oh, I am too. But we have good food. Yeah, but like I, I already did write down names that I want to try out, like Motura. Oh! Whoa! Is it his, is it him? Is it Tunde who, who, who advised you? No, so like I was at the um, Kenyatta University. <gasps> so the students there told me that I should specially try that in the night. Yeah! <laughs> ah, let me tell you something about him. You've gotten me all excited. <laughs> Mutura is yeah. not something you can just eat from anywhere. So you must be inducted into a particular base, you understand? Mm. Like, <laughs> Mm -hmm. We have different hoods and everything, and each one of them has several places to eat mtura, but it's only that like that one that has a bag, you know? Oh. So you have to know I'm your actually, way around. So I'm, so I'm taking my time. Yes. I'm taking my time. And then mtura, you can't just order it like in bulk. It, it, the sweetness is when it's cut and it's small portions. Oh. Yeah, and you must eat it standing. Mm. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Dipping it in salt and and salsa. Now you catch salsa and uh, yeah. and then the darkness, as you said, is a must. Exactly. It's say that's key one of the recipe. Yeah, key, very key. Wow. Yeah. All right. What else do you want to try? Um, chapati. Uh, do you have something equivalent to chapati at home? Um, I don't know. Like I, like, like a paratha. 
So I don't know. What, what I do that. What's the um, chapati made of? Like flour, basically. So I don't. I don't know if we will have something like that. Whoa. What kind of food do you have? Okay. What? What? What does suji taste like? Um, I don't understand why it's so stretchy. What and I have questions. Suji. What? Suji. <laughs> yeah. Is that Nigerian food? Is that suji? No. That the one that's that's is stretchy. Is that okra? Or is it fufu? Or what is that? The first one. Okra. Oh? Yeah. What's soup. that? Uh huh. Oh, what do you eat like, it with? Um, um, pounder yam or like fufu. That's yeah, what I meant to yeah. say. Fufu. Oh, why does it taste like that? Why is it so stretchy, the fufu? Uh, I, I guess because it's, it's been pounded, you know, so it, oh. it's cassava and stuff. Yeah. Oh, yeah. we have something similar, but it's not as. Uh, it's, uh, yeah, it's quite solid. <laughs> yeah, so I think, I think you should try that. It's nice. Yeah? Mm -hmm. What else would you advise me to try? I like spicy food. Oh, you like spicy food? Yeah. Then you should, you should try. You should try Ewa Goin. Ewa. Yeah. Ewa Goin. Ewa Goin. Yeah. Describe it for me, please. It's like beans uh -huh. with bread, uh -huh. especially made on the streets. Oh, I like street food. Tour, right? Hey, uh, okay, so we have a vibe. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Clearly, we, there's a vibe here in studio. That. I like that. Okay, okay, that's enough about food. Tell me about what it, what it meant for you to put this album together. The effort, um, the challenges. Did you have to postpone anything? Did something not work out when you were on it? Um, the album stopped me a lot. You know, I, I was I've been working on it for three years. Three years. Yeah. So like, it's been a journey. You know, it's, I've been learning and learning, and I've just let unit the universe do her thing. You know, so when something happens i feel like it's meant to happen so i just i've just been following like everything that has been happening you know till like the album was ready you know it's been uploaded so many times and it's been taken down so many times because i wanted it to be taken down you know because i had I had like new songs or i had something i needed to correct wow. you know so like but yeah it's a special work because i want to look back at it like 10 years from now and know that okay my first debut is solid mm. and you know I'm proud of myself three years sounds okay yes both sounds like a long and short time and long because I I have seen artists kind of want to jump into the EP thing or album thing yeah. real quick and hey three years on one project yeah and it's it's worth it you know because mm. of the type of music I make you know so I didn't want to rush it I just mm. wanted to take my time and put out because it's a, like it's a project you know and it's not just a project it's what i stand for mm -hmm. you know i'm i am a citizen of the world so it's best i introduce myself you know with my work as an identity like this is what i stand for before i start showing you guys to okay. music yes exactly <coughs> clears the road mm -hmm. okay <laughs> why citizen of the world I, are you a global citizen do you yeah like i said it's a, it's a mind state it's an identity you know, it's, there's no boundaries to my music, you know. There are people who, you know, they, whatever they do, it's, it's not just of one place. It's of the world, you know, with their craft. You know, not just artists, mm -hmm. you know, the, you know, it goes with Anthony Joshua is a boxer, you know, but mm -hmm. we all come together to watch him fight. Mm -hmm. You know, Nelson Mandela stands for something, you know. Mm -hmm. You know, Muhammad Ali, you know, Fela Kuti. Mm -hmm. But Mali, these are things, people that they, when they did things, the world did listen to them. And, you know, they saved, they, they, they spread love mm -hmm. through their office, you know, with whatever they were doing, you know. So I feel like I needed to put a name to that, you know, as a global citizen. Like, this is what I stand for. And this is who I am, you know, with my music, you know, with my craft. And already I have, like, people around the world listening to my music, uh, which is a great thing. And I don't think it's a normal thing mm -hmm. it's a special thing to have people from like countries where they don't understand english you know vibe to my music mm -hmm. like solid vibe into my music you mm -hmm. know so i feel like it's a special thing for me because music is like a universal language so for that that makes me a, a citizen of the world and a global citizen so if you know you do something out there you know with your craft and you know that like you're here to spread love to the world with your craft you know you're a citizen of the world okay oh, we have two questions i'll start with the people who you have highlighted about marley's and 
those are pretty heavy names. Do you mm. have a mentor, like someone who's a legend right now, or you just like the what they did or that the so, name remained? So like, um, I was signed to like um, one of my like favorite artists. You know, like I listen, I, I listen to him while growing up. My dad plays his music a lot. Hey, yeah, that. and um, funny how like, you know, I got into like his part, and he, mm -hmm. I was signed to his label, and Timaya, <gasps> I was signed to, I was signed to his label, and it feels great seeing like the world from his own like perspective. You know, that's like built me in a very very strong way that I know that in decades to come, in years to come, like I'm solid. You know because. It's from, I'm, I'm coming from like the legend, like the legend put me on. So like, it's amazing. Do you know how long I've loved Demaya? Since, since Demaya sang Demaya. They call yeah, me Demaya. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, like back, yeah. woo! That's a legend right there, you know? Please tell him I said hello. Yeah, I will. You may forget. I will, I will, trust <laughs> me. <laughs> that I said hello. I will, I will. <laughs> That honor, that greatness has made me weak in the knees a little bit. I'm, <laughs> I'm glad to be, I'm glad to be in your presence appreciate right it. now. Thank okay. you. Okay. Damn. Thank you. Okay. Okay. If you could choose something about yourself, you know how we are humans, yes? Yeah. And we have a lot of different parts that we show different people. The way I am behaving right now on TV is not the way I behave in front of my parent, perhaps, yeah. or my sibling, or my landlord, you know? Yeah. So... Is there a part of you that you don't show anyone? And would one day, will it shine, would it come out with a vibe, you understand? So if maybe you're low key, very soft and mushy and love dovey on the inside, so one day you'll just kind of incline your music that way. Or if you're angry and, and we find out you can rap too, I'm like, oh, are you gonna channel it there? You understand? Okay, so I hmm. think, but I think I'm beginning to come out on my shell, you know? I used to, I, I paint. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I don't. I, I do that on the like inside. I don't really like show that out. And He's very good. Yeah, I paint, and um, I'm a very quiet person. Uh, but I like to talk around my people that I trust, mm -hmm. that I, like I love people, like I, I'm comfortable around, you know. Mm -hmm. But other than that, I'm a very laid back, chill person. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, so basically what you're giving us right now is what he said is him. Yeah, yeah it is just vibing. If you've listened to his music, he has a very, very kunaka <laughs> vibe. I don't know how else to describe it. There's no word. So that's basically how what it sounds like. So hey, translate it into if it was a person, it really is a person. Okay, now wrapping the question. Where, where do you plan on, do you have a place you want to visit around here in Kenya? In Kenya? Yeah. Oh man, I think I would have to come back because I, I, I would be leaving soon. So I want to come back to Kenya properly this time, not to do any, like work. I just want to enjoy myself, hey. you know? Yeah, so I want to go to the safari. I want to check out the uh -huh. lions. Uh -huh. I want to see my people, you know? Uh -huh. Oh, you have people there? The lions, you know? <laughs> Ah, <laughs> who is that? Yeah. This one now, Allah. I see, I want to see my people. Uh huh. All right. No. Okay. If you yeah. insist, <laughs> if you insist, also yeah. go to the coast. They have really, really good spots, and it's not as cold. Yeah, it's so mm. cold. Yeah, man. Mm. That that that's a place. It's on a wheel. <laughs> Are you adjusting because of the cold? Yeah, it's cold. <laughs> very, very. You're really not used to it. At all. Ah, okay. Would you collaborate with someone? in Kenya or do you have someone in mind? Is no, I've been listening to like great music here, you know. I had the Sipan Gwing Gwing song. <laughs> <laughs> I like that one. It's a hit. It's special. Do you know what it means? Yeah, you don't tell me what to do in my life. Hey! Yeah, I like I like that one special, you know. That's <laughs> a jam right there. Uh-huh. Yeah, then um no very real the storyteller I think. Yeah. Great guy. I love Southie Soul too. Mm-hmm. Mm. All right. So I, I see you've already found your niche. Yeah, I, 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 I like just, the music they make. Just move here and just start nah. singing with this old generation yeah, yeah. people. You don't want. I can't. Like, Why? I'm, I'm here to like connect the dots and <laughs> go to another. Then connect the dots. Yeah, and just go. Just, you know, I'm a global citizen, so it's only, yeah, 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 it's yeah, only yeah, right yeah. that I do this we around the world. We heard you the first time. Exactly. You can do it online. Nah. <laughs>
uh, it's, it's better touch. when you go there and connect with the people. Mm -hmm. You know, special just the way I'm here right now. You. We're connecting. Exactly. How does it feel when you hear people, you know, just singing along to your jams to a country you've never been to ever? You know, special because. Trust me, I We don't. You ask, we like free things. So if we've been <laughs> camp, see you. Yes, pleasure. Yeah, it's very, very special, you know, because that's one of the like reasons why I make music, you know, to heal the world, you know, to spread message, you know, spread love. So when people listen to my music and they smile, I'm fine. Mm. That's it. You like, will start singing one day, heartbreak, if it's affected. Mm? Because I heard sometimes artists use what's in their surroundings. So say, for example, someone heart breaks your heart. Yeah, I mean, I'm a very, like, introverted person. So, like, the mic is how, like, the mic is it's one like of the journal. reasons where, like, I s s mm. like, speak my mind, express myself, you know. So, like, it, wherever I feel, I speak to the mic, you know. And so on the album, there are, like, different energies, moods that you need to, when you listen to the album, you could tell. Whatever you're hearing is from my heart, from mm -hmm. African boy, Season of the world, cream de la cream, yawa, what can grind, like that's all like me, you know. Mm. Yeah. You're very confident. You've never felt shy to expose. It's like being seen naked. Um. So like that's why that's why like I feel like the music just gives me like a house around me, you know. So I think I, f I I'm I'm not a very expressive person, you know. But my music is where you find me being expressive. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so. Can I tell you a secret? We're complete opposites. I have one song. Been in the studio once. Yeah. Once like this. Was that heartbreak? Did you no, that it was actually, it was like a bum bum kind of <laughs> bump along. Yeah, I, had, I have a song like that, The Funny Kato. Aha, aha. It's going crazy on TikTok. You know, you should go check it out. Challenge. Yeah, but I Make your body go people. bum. Bum. Hey, bum. by the which reminds me, your Instagram. Yeah. Whoa, it is, it's, it's, <laughs> it's, eh. Big hey. shout out to big shout out to Kenyans. The hey. Kenyans hey. They've been showing me so much love. Hey. They like the song a lot. All those are Kenyans. Mm -hmm. You, you're coming back. Definitely. This one has you know. come back. I see Definitely. now. I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna leave some part of me here, you know, and just go and come back. Some part. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> In conclusion, yeah. sir, what would you like to tell your fans? Um, I like to. Thank you guys for you know always showing me support. I love you guys a lot. Stay true to yourself. Keep supporting the boy. Follow me on my social media account at King Perry K I N G P E W R Double Y. Bless. Mhm. You want to smile just a little bit, just at least so you know, never you know, accomplish something. There, <laughs> we smiling, there we go. Know, there yeah. we go. There we go. That's all I wanted. Thank <laughs> you. I am Thank now you. satisfied. Yeah. Santi. Ah, look at that. Okay, how do I say thank you? In pigeon. In pigeon. Ah, thank you now. Just thank that you. it. Yeah. Just thank you. Yeah. <laughs> it's right. pigeon. That was very anticlimactic. <laughs> Register DJ. We're about to leave. D, you are ready? Yeah. You are ready? Okay. Do you have anything to ask, sir, over here? When I just see all the time we have, sir, superstar, please. <laughs> hmm? Address him quickly, no? Yeah, we put us where he is. Mm-hmm. We want to know where you'll be performing. Oh, I'm from Enugu State, the eastern part mm -hmm. of Nigeria. I was born in the south mm -hmm. of Nigeria, in Potakot, River State. Igbo? Yeah, I'm Igbo. Oh. Mm -hmm. Why are you always fighting Yoruba? Okay, but anyway, that's not No, we, we don't have. fight. You no. don't fight? No. So the media is lying to us? Whatever you see on the media is it's a lie. We are one. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Good to know. Good to know. But he asked, are you performing? Yeah, oh, I'm, I'm going to be at Gucci Lounge tonight, mm -hmm. having a good time, so come out, let's have fun. Oh, are you performing or are you just there? I might. You might. <laughs> okay. <laughs> will you be aloof in the VIP section so people won't be able no, to No, I'll have... be with my people. Man. How many people do you have? Like Everybody 50? in the club. Everybody ah, in the club. Is okay, okay. I like that. Oh, I like yeah. that. I mean, we need to vibe. Okay, it, it, we gotta leave. Yay! Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, we gotta leave. We gotta go. Sorry, I had way too much fun over here. So apparently, Rajiv the DJ are gonna form. See, I'm sure some are gonna form. Now, the case is tomorrow. Tomorrow, I'm scared. What you are made of? You what you are chuka? Street? Nikosa? Eh? No, what you are Anyway, just follow Rajiv the DJ.
on all social media platforms. Had his Instagram and all the nice ones, Twitter, Nyef, Nyef, TikTok. D, what are you happy? 159 along Kangunda Road to Tower uh -huh. Petrol Station. Okay. Watu wakoma. Nasereka. How do we find you on social media, D? D J D double E J. Okay. K Y double E underscore K E. Your Instagram. Facebook's the same. Instagram. Okay. Twitter. Hey, I, did, I didn't expect him to keep going. D E W Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z it is the festive season and we care about our people. We want you to enjoy men properly. Are we together? Tonight, Fanyaga? Bali. Yes. Hashtag is a social Friday. Bye bye.